<laughs> was, you mentioned was there a time at SC where you thought this is it for me? I mean, people in LA, a lot of people can't understand why they said Pete Carroll's in the perfect job. You can ride off into the sunset. I, did, I did absolutely thought that and operated with that thinking. Um, and particularly after talking to a few clubs over the years, it would look like I talked to six clubs every year. That didn't happen. It wasn't like that at all. There was a few phone calls that, that we took and, and, and talked to guys to find out you know, what they're thinking. I was really clear that, and I said it a ton of times, that I can't ever see me leaving because I can't see the situation arising in the NFL after going through this where they're going to give me the opportunity to do it the way I want to do it. And so I just canceled out the realistic thought that it was going to happen. And so that when this thing popped, it didn't take us very long because it was so clear that, that Todd had, and, and Paul had orchestrated it and, and it structured it exactly the, the way that it needed to be to make sense to me. And so, uh, so then that mindset of you know never, never wanting to leave shifted because this is the, this is the, the extreme. This is the top level that you can find in this world of football to compete at. It's, it's, the, it's the level that has all of the resources, has all of the backing, all of the hype, the very best of the best. And to me, that's I, 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 I can't avoid that opportunity if, I, if the chance was there. 